गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून गुड इवनिंग और इस डिपेंडिंग ऑफ द प्लेस यू आर लिस्टनिंग एस फ्रॉम थैंक यू टू बी ऑलवेज चून इन एम बी एम के टी वी न्यूज लेट मी नो योर कंट्री और योर टाउन बेट मी आई एम अम्बासडर गबूल अम्बाला योर होस्ट ऑफ टूडे एंड आई एम लोगिंग फ्रॉम आवर सेंट्रल अफ्रीका स्टूडियो welcome 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 let me uh, quickly remind you to do not forget to like to share and to follow watch it till the end let's go quickly on the topic of today you have certainly read it in the description so we are but the question is what or we are we and the answer is that we are certainly something greater than all you can imagine we are such important such precious that god cannot let us suffer on earth why am i telling you such things my question for you to understand me is do you already have accepted that the kingdom of god is the only gospel of king jesus christ if no now it's the right time to do that if yes let me open your mind by the holy spirit and let me show you what you represent now because you must know who you are open your bible and let us read together 1 peter chapter 2 verse 9 let me read for you 1 peter chapter 2 verse 9 it said but you are chosen people a royal priest who a holy nation a people for God's own possession to proclaim the virtues of him who called you out of darkness into his marvelous light amen let me take the first part of that verse you are a chosen people god chose all those who believe that the kingdom of god is the only gospel of Jesus Christ and that's not all he chose again all who accept to live the same way of life that king jesus as it is described in the bible our constitution we are people because we are a people because we are the diplomatic representation of the kingdom of god on the earth we are a chosen people because of the kingdom of god let me take the second part of that verse a royal priesthood we are a royal priesthood we are priesthood because through us the world is viewing the big picture of god the priest is the one who can connect god to the people but currently that people is the world and we are the representation of the shape of god of his spirit and of his soul we are the real picture and the real resemblance of god as his will is since the beginning let me take the third part of that special verse we are a holy nation we are citizens of the kingdom of god and the kingdom of god is the only will of god the will of god is like god himself it is holy what does it mean the word holy means reserved or put aside so that word means clearly that we are not of that world because our reality on the earth is the one of the kingdom of god and the kingdom of god is our true nation let me take the fourth part of that verse we are a people for god's own possession why just because god did the right thing to be our owner he sent king jesus to preach us about the kingdom of god to teach us abundantly concerning the kingdom of god businesses to die and to resurrect as a perfect figure of the kingdom and king jesus called us his spouse and he is calling us his church yes that's really incredible and 
all that explain perfectly why the aim of that verse is to proclaim the virtues of him who call you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Let me conclude for you. Do you know now who or what you are? Read it deeply and remember in 1 Peter chapter 2 verse 9. As we said in MBN, we are a chosen people. We are a royal priesthood. We are a holy nation. We are a people for God's own possession. And we are here to proclaim the virtues of him who called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Let me say you that God is taking care of you and of your entire family. The Holy Spirit opens your mind right now to understand who we are. Stay tuned. Amen. Stay always connected. You are blessed.